Welcome to Movie Rage. I'm Jeremy. I'm James. So we're going to talk about Fast Six. Oh yes. What were, your, what were your thoughts on it, man? Because I I thought it was it was action packed. The story was good. Uh, you know, uh, you know, brought everybody you know from the previous ones in. Uh, you know, I'm not too sure about the the whole Letty situation. Right. Kind of, you know, it's like how well, it's a person that you know they got to die and bring back. And, and, <laughs> I know what you're saying. You know. But I mean, I mean, it was, it was pretty good. I mean, the car chases were great. Yeah, I mean, that, it seemed like they had a little more like, action, you know, yeah. action than than you know, still had the good car chases. But right. You know, but what are you, what are your thoughts on it? I'm sorry. I mean, oh no, man, I thought it was pretty good. Um, it led up to a lot where you know, the story of the saga finally, you know, was coming into place. Which gets me is is that so many people are like, oh, another Fast Six and this and that. There are so many sagas out there. As long as the storyline's good, you know, I'll, I'll continue to watch them. Right. You know, I mean, everything fell into place. I thought, you know, with Vin Diesel and The Rock working back together, you know, a little more closely in this film, I was very pleased with how it turned out. You know, the whole, the whole thing, uh, like you said, there was a lot more fighting than car chases, but I liked that. It yeah. gave it a, you know, even though everyone's like, oh, it's about cars. Well, you saw some pretty mean cars in this guy. Gotta film. get out that car sooner or later. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, knuckling up, this is what it really needed. It needed some knuckling down with some people, you know. And I love how the storyline was where it will lead to where, remember, we found out that there is going to be a Fast 7. And just to let you know, this will take place from the Fast 6. And it will tell the finishing story, I believe, to Fast 7. But overall, my opinion on it, it was very good compared to what everyone else said, you know. Yeah, I liked it. I, you know. Yeah. I mean. Pure entertainment. Yeah, it was. It was very good. Um, I mean, well, like, what was your, like, at least let's shoot them up. What was your, like, kind of favorite scene in it? Close at to the end, it. after the credits. Or not, not like close to the credits when they f totally cut all ties to Tokyo Drift. Right, that was my favorite part. Yeah, I'll, I'll agree with you there because that's what was upsetting me was Tokyo Drift and how it fell in play. But once you saw and, it, and yeah. spoiler, Jason Statham in the next uh, Fast Se Yeah, you know. Fast Seven. So, but yeah, at least it'll tell you how everything is, and it it, it gave me closure. As I, we hope it gives you guys closure with Tokyo Drift because I'm honest, glad they did it that way. Though. Yeah, I'm very pleased with how they did it. Um, overall, go see it if you haven't seen it. Do it before you know it gets out of theaters. If not, wait until it comes out on DVD. You will not be disappointed. It's very good. We give it you know two thumbs up. I would so, if I had thumbs. Yeah. So Jeremy gives it two fingers up. <laughs> Maybe two toes. All depends on how I'm feeling that day. Until next time, hey. we're out. Peace. Peace.